tell that? Oh, I wanted to. We've had so many people come in and tell us to try and do podcasts and stuff like that in here just with us goofing off. I think so you Casey's going to just shoot a little bit here while we're while he's here today and just kind of. TJ is the first guest on the Buzz and Faded podcast. Yeah, hey. <laughs> <laughs> Well, perfect would have probably been Caesar, but... Uh, Caesar didn't get a haircut. He did? Yeah. He just came in here and stuck his nub in the He came in and got money because he lost a bet to Pender, and Pender left him money for it. Mm-hmm. So he's, so he's grown his hair out. So he's grown his hair out, and mm-hmm. he's started keto. Oh, he's, really? He's well, turned he's... into a white guy more and more every day. Yeah, he is. He mm-hmm. said he just got his passport, too. We're like, you're definitely the white guy. Oh, God, Caesar. Was he going on a cruise or something? Uh, supposed to be going on a cruise sometime. That's what that's yeah. something. Yeah. Cesar. Cesar. He wants to start a segment on our podcast called uh, uh, Whose Drink Did Caesar Put His Nub In This Week? Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> oh. So this week it was uh, Ted Schumann. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> That's just not right. Uh, it's hilarious. <laughs> they tell you not to leave your drinks exactly. unattended in bars. Especially Caesar. Yeah, I, mean. <laughs> I mean, you're not supposed to, so. Nub of the week, then. Nub of the week. I saw uh, Alexa picked Eagles to win the Super Bowl. Everything's picking the Eagles to win the freaking Super Bowl. Madden picked them, I think. What Madden? Yeah, yeah, I've seen on TikTok that Madden, like several people have done their own run through. Oh, on Madden? Yeah, a Madden one. That has Eagles winning by like three. A bunch. So. I've seen one where it's like it had the Eagles winning like 44 to 17 or something like that. I made a Mahomes build on my 2K team and we whipped the piss out of the 96 Bulls, if that means anything. I made a Mahomes <laughs> yeah. on your 2K oh, yeah. <laughs> He is a baller. I mean, no matter where you put him, he's a baller. I made him, made him on my MLB The Show. Did you guys see that he TikTok? There was a TikTok of him like pulling up to a rec league or some shit. And he went in there and just, I mean, he went like dunking on a bunch like of Like basketball? Yeah. Yeah, I did. So yeah. And they're like, you know, pretty shifty ball handles and shit. He can't do that around. anymore. Yeah. Ever since he signed his big contract, they told him no more pickup basketball games. I figured. I didn't realize he had that crazy ass voice. You never heard his voice? I mean, I've heard it, but I never, you know, with all the interviews and shit this week, I've been really listening. I'm like, this dude's got a crazy Dude, voice. It's Kermit the Frog. Yeah, for sure. Said. I just want to take my wife. Throw the rap in her. My daughter's starting in my, my son's rods. <laughs> oh my God. Who are you talking about? My home. My oh, yeah. <laughs> Love <laughs> football. <laughs> okay, he's still beautiful. <laughs> His son, bronze. You know why I call him bronze? Because he couldn't make it to gold? Because he's Patrick Mahomes. <laughs> so I call him bronze. He's third place is bronze. Oh. That's all right. We knew we'd have to explain it to you for you to catch up. See, the first one's gold, then silver. No, but not even normal today. So, yeah, so the first one, like nice. said, is gold. And then he would be so silver because he's the second. Oh, so they call the sun bronze because he's the third. Yeah, that's done. That's one thing, God! Oh, no, stop! <laughs> 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 Yeah. He can say he wasn't coming until noon today. Um, that's what I say. That's the time I haven't seen him. So. When do you guys start parking on the grass? I like that. Siobhan and Coulter do it. Siobhan and Coulter do it. That thing, you know, just across the road over there is too far to walk. That's VIP parking on this side. You see where I park. Yeah, that's what me and Coulter said. Yeah. That's <laughs> where VIP, okay? That's where we fucking park. We got our own parking spaces. Freaking Coulter and Phoenix had to work till 8.30 last night. Damn. Wow. Yeah, we were getting it. No idea. I hope it's a glitter bomb. <laughs> How awesome would that be on your first podcast? The whole podcast glitter bomb? <laughs> <laughs> Somebody new. It's not glitter, it's anthrax. Shit. And I'm Sandler's this weekend. Did y'all get tickets for that? No. Cole was not to us. No. Where's it at? Kansas City. City. Oh, nice. Was just he's doing stand up? Mm-hmm. Uh huh. Oh. Oh, 
it's just an intro, so. A R B. No. I'm just <laughs> Don't laugh. It happens quicker than you think. A R B. Yes. Yes. A R B. Don't do it, bro. <laughs> got the new address on it and phone number. Turned out pretty good. I still think that it would look a lot better if you got Phoenix. We do the billboard? Yeah. Laying on a bear rug. The billboard's so definitely it. We're thinking about doing a big billboard. <laughs> no, we're not. <laughs> we're not <laughs> so that in bear rug. So in, front of it, yeah. in the front of it, we're going to have like a big old bear rug and Phoenix can be like shirtless, just like sprawled out on it. <laughs> You know, kind of like doing no, that like up, upward dog pose on it, you yeah. know? And it's going to say, Venus. <laughs> do that think. upward dog pose real quick. Yeah, get under and do that real quick. Yeah, I know. But can I, can do I, the like, downward dog pose. Yeah. You know? And then we're going to have, like, on one side, it'll have me. And I'm going to have, like, a couple, like, like deli slicers. And I'm going to have, like, some of those twisted up sausages, like, around my neck, like a, like a, like a gun belt almost. There you go. And it's going to say, cold cuts. <laughs> And then we're going to have Siobhan, like, backing it up, like, twerk style. Yeah. It's going to say, the Chevy. The Chevy. <laughs> and then we're going to have Coulter in a cowboy hat and a duster. Yeah. He's a straw out of his mouth. It's going to say, Colt 45. <laughs> you got that all figured out. But, I mean, we really just need Phoenix on. That's all we need. Yeah, really. That's, I mean, None that's of that's happening. Like, the Phoenix. The Phoenix. You should do one of those uh, signs that turns. That turns one's a different one. Like, every one. <laughs> People just sitting there all day waiting on the Phoenix. <laughs> he just shows we, up every we, we third. We want two. We want the Chevy and the Phoenix. Yeah. Every third time it, it rolls around, you see the Phoenix. But the Colt 45 every time the Chevy shows up, there's a bunch of car wrecks out there. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God! Well, he wanted to put it. Oh. I was gonna put it in front of my Lost Boys. Yeah, that's the only option. <laughs> Right above Lost yep. Boys. I think you just get a badass muralist and just have it paint a mural like that on the side of Lost Boys. <laughs> <laughs> Middle of the night, go over to it. They come in like, man, this sucks, but this is too badass. To take down. <laughs> Phoenix! <laughs> Phoenix! <laughs> you want to call her, we know you don't want to call her the Chevy, right? Get that, get that junk in the trunk. Got a plow on the front, the junk in the trunk. <laughs> plow on the front. <laughs> oh my god. Oh man. How come the old Celtics didn't pick up any good players, Venus? What do we need it for? Well, you guys are screwed now, bro. Think so? Oh yeah. I mean, we beat the Sixers last two nights ago. Two nights ago with one starter. Well, that's six. We had two starters, but one took the other one out. Did you see that? Yeah. Tatum take Brown out? Yeah, I did see that. I smoked him right in his cheekbone. Yeah. Man, that'd be painful. I saw the Bucks beat the crap out of the Lakers last night. That was awesome. Well, of course. LeBron I watched, doesn't I even play. First, I know. Beats the record and then just quits. This what, that's what this what ticked me out about that. Like, Kareem and them are all there. Yeah. Like, still to watch him, yeah. like, do it. Like, keep making like, history. His boys yeah. are both there. Yeah. Kareem's there. Everybody's there. He's on the bench in a suit. Yeah. yeah he's the biggest piece of crap. I'm definitely not a fan. No. Nope. I was watching all that stuff with AD, too, you know, not standing up when he scored and all that. He's mad, bro. Yeah. He's mad. He wants to win. <laughs> it's more important for the team to win to him than it is for LeBron to continue to chat, chase all these stats and make sure that he goes down as the you know, highest scorer of all time. That's like, what he, they interviewed him. That's what he even said. He's like, you guys know my relationship with LeBron. He's like, I'm just sad we're losing all the freaking time. He's like, it's depressing. Yeah. And you can't blame him, like, no, you maybe can't. he's obviously not as old as LeBron, so he's still got time in the game, right. quite a bit left, and he just wants to win, so. No, I mean, we picked up that big dude from Oklahoma City. Yeah. And. Is he going to be worth anything? I mean, he's like, uh, 
in the top three of uh, big men outside shooters. Like, they say that he he hits at least three threes every single game he's played in. That big guy does? Yeah. No kidding. So, and we traded him for, you know, um, Jackson that comes off our bench. So, and that dude only comes off the bench whenever, like, we're destroying a team or the occasion that we're getting beat. Like, Thanks for going and telling Cooper about my Kobe deal. Which, what was it? But what I said about Kobe. Oh, my God. Oh, yeah, he was like. Somebody would say that to me, I'll punch him right in the face. Did you tell you what he messaged me? Uh-uh. <laughs> I'm like, that was your Uncle Coley. I woke that. up He's the like, next morning and I got text messages from him. I got, uh, You're so dead there's to me? no way some guy named, <laughs> but, so there's no way some guy named Thomas Bryant is greater than Kobe. I put it back, I put, oh yeah he is. He could beat Kobe one-on-one today. <laughs> oh my God. That was bad. Oh. <laughs> he just said back Kobe could eat all these guys alive, especially LeBron. I just left it at that. Oh my god. He'd be like, Kobe's eating anybody now, he's a zombie, bro. <laughs> Detach the head. <laughs> he could beat him one on one today. <laughs> that ain't my fault, man. LeBron's terrible. Now I'm curious to see how the game goes tonight. Celtics got a lot of guys out playing the Hornets. Are they getting any of them back tonight? Uh, Hornets traded Plumlee and got Reggie Jackson from the Clippers. Yep. And, and uh, I've seen uh, the Hornets did. Mm-hmm. Plumlee was pretty good. Crowder went somewhere. Where yeah, Crowder went. Uh, did he land with? I think Clippers? he went to uh, the Clippers. Yeah, him. Uh, maybe I can't remember where you went. Man, I feel bad for old uh, Westbrook. Right. Yeah, Westbrook's like that dude just keeps on getting bounced. He everywhere. may as well retire now, dude. He's just signs a five-year deal with the Thunder, and every year he's played for a different team since then. Yeah. Did you see that thing in the, that video that was going around of them in the locker room? LeBron's like, ah, right, here we go. Time to get greedy. Now's our time. And so Westbrook's like, 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 hey guys, hey guys. Just go ahead and have some fun. What do you say? Everybody's like, yeah, yeah, bro. Next day, traded. <laughs> That's what happened? Yeah. I mean, that was the lead was, up to yeah, it. Yeah, that was literally the lead up. Like, after that game. So LeBron's uh, coming in, like, trying to get them all pumped up, and the Westbrook's, like, calming them down? Yeah, yeah. basically. Basically. We said him and Darvin Ham got in The next day, he traded. Like, you don't, don't be talking to my team. LeBron's like, look at him. Like, He's like, stay humble and... And no matter what, y'all just keep on having fun. You know it's Mac Jones in a commercial? Oh, yeah. He's in a couple of them. No good? Yeah. So, like, when's Durant supposed to be back after the All-Star break? Well, see, his his injury, he's been out for a little over a month now, and his injury is a sprain MCL. So, I don't know, man. I really thought this is just my own hypothetical I, I thought that he was gonna wait until after the all-star break and then come back strong right after that now with him doing it with the Suns man it could get really nasty in the West like the West got super strong just overnight one guy this morning said he thought AD would go to the Suns too yeah just for them to make a run at it well, Kyrie's first game with the Mavs he did good yeah 24 high point man they won. You get Luca back, they're going to be nasty. They're going to be super nasty. And honestly, his injury is is so, it's to me, it's minimal. Like, I feel like the only reason that Luke is out is because he's just trying to let his heel rest. Right. Because I read the report on it, and it just said that he had, like, some heel soreness. So, Dude, all those guys just sit around this time of year waiting on the playoffs and shit. Yeah. You know, once they get to they're a certain try- point, they're like, They're trying to make sure that they've – basically almost got into the playoffs even if it is a wild card spot and then come back like two months before <laughs> a month before and try to get a good seed and then then they're good to go like 
we did something out of curiosity because, you know, LeBron was drafted at 18. We went back and took Kareem's stats from college and added them into his total points. He had 41,000. Okay, well, even, even another one better for you. I actually watched a video yesterday on a guy. He sat down and averaged out what Jordan scored each season You're saying that. and then took the two years that he took off and added those points to what he actually ended with. He would have had like 43,000. Like, right. So his numbers would have been way higher. So well, and There was this whole list that showed like all these current players, like Anthony Kumbo and Booker and all these guys that are still playing. It's like if he plays it this year, he's going to beat it. If he plays it this year, he's going to beat it. If he plays it this year, he's going to beat it. You know? Tatum's on that. That's what I mean. Somewhere. You know, um, Tatum's almost at 10,000 10, right now. He's on his sixth year. You know what I mean? I keep saying, too, like if they ever, which I don't know that they will, but if they would ever start letting them draft right out of high school, um, It'd go and, back to that. and you got a you got a kid that uh, that's as dominant and just ice in his veins as Steph Curry coming right out of high school. Right. Oh, he had smoked that record. You mean hitting threes like that? Oh yeah. Yeah. Or Damian Lillard. Or, or Damian Lillard. Yeah. And how many Le- you know threes LeBron had compared to Kareem? Yeah, Kareem, Kareem had, had one. one. <laughs> yeah. yeah. That's why I said they ought to take total number of buckets made. Kareem would be way ahead of him. Way ahead of him. Ah, LeBron's just a accomplishment chaser, dude. That's all, That's it, all is. it is now. Absolutely. You know, just a, I mean, I, out of all of his things, it's kind of impressive to me that he he's number one on the scoring list. And he's number four on the assist list. That's yeah. the one thing That's that kind of impresses me. You know what I mean? Like that He'll shit. never beat Stockton. Stockton still got it by you know, 10,000 or whatever right. it is, you know. I mean, it just shows that he's not as a big of a ball hog as you would think with him having the leading score record. Like, you would think that yeah, he, don't want the he ball. wouldn't pass the ball at all. Yeah. He wants but, it in the first three quarters, and then he's done. Yeah. I watched a video the other day just because I was mad at him. Typed in the LeBron's worst plays or whatever. Yeah. Oh, you can watch low lights for days. So many of those. You can watch, like, flop videos, low So lights. many flop videos. There's oh. this one, like, there's this guy the other day posted this video. like, this Jordan guy's your guy's goat? It was literally Jordan's three turnovers of his whole career. <laughs> that was it. I'm like, damn, bro. You had, wow. a, you had a you search for those. Yeah. Up. You really stuck it to us, bro. Yeah. I seen that. I seen a million where like LeBron was going for like the the last game winning shot, like dribbles it off his foot. Yeah, it's like that one where we were watching the other day. Where he rolls the ball down the court and yeah. kicks it out of bounds. Kicks it out of bounds. <laughs> yeah. I mean, you would too if you had a foot that was like twenty three inches long. Yeah. Big old foot, foot on a man. Yeah. Old you know what I'm saying, Chef? <laughs> <laughs> what? What? Huh? Yeah. Let's say about big feet. Earmuffs. Oh. Big shoes. Earmuffs. Tippy toe. I wasn't going to say anything about it. Where big socks, though? Where do you have a girl? Big old socks that's on a That's something that she. Hey, Siobhan, what do you call a nose with no body? A nobody. Nobody knows. Nobody knows. There we go again. Is that a bird? Yep. Uh-huh. Okay, man. Trying to clean up the back of your neck. I heard that on TikTok last night. Did you really? Brother. Last night? I swear to God, last that's night. That's wild. Nobody knows. That was pretty good. Not as good as the chicken, but... Definitely not as good as the chicken joke. Not as good as the chicken, but... I mean... Well, what's a chicken joke? Uh, I'm not uh, let me think, uh, what is it, how's the joke go? What's the best thing about a chicken? Is that I what it is? No. no. Well, you could use, like, you know, why did the chicken cross the road? Uh, why did the chicken cross the road? Because! <laughs> Oh, no, I saw that freaking <laughs> dancing <laughs> cowboy guy doing that. <laughs> I seen, uh, you know, my, my favorite not not joke forever was the interrupting cow one. You ever heard that one? Yeah. I'd seen one the other day. It's kind of like that one. It's, it's uh, great, Siobhan. Not not. Control freak. No, 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 no. You say, now you say control freak who? <laughs> I thought that was great. No, I think you seriously stay up late at night and just look up what are the stupidest jokes I can say today. Uh, Yeah. I I do have a bad joke of the week, though. You ready for that one? (laughs) Okay. This is my favorite one. This this is for Phoenix. You ready, Phoenix? Oh, my God. (laughs) Why does Snoop Dogg use an umbrella? For drizzle. For drizzle. (laughs) (laughs) Literally popped in my head. For drizzle. Sorry, Phoenix, I didn't mean so to that <laughs> <laughs> I love it. <laughs> Why does Snoop Dogg use an umbrella? 
a drizzle. Mm -hmm. Probably very dumb. <laughs> You guys need to really do something. <laughs> Phoenix hates when I say for shizzle. <laughs> so I, I seen that one. I was like, that is so good for drizzle. You said so good. You want one? Yeah, anytime any kids come in here and they're like, they're talking some of their lingo, you know, no cap and bet and stuff like that, I'll go, I know I talk like you fellas. Yeah, for shizzle. For shizzle. For shizzle. <laughs> Because they don't use that anymore, ever. Nobody ever uses that. Dead ass. Any time we ever get a tea from the place down here, I always put that. Got, got our squeezy for cheesy. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Phoenix. No, don't laugh. It only encourages. It, it only further encourages the behavior. For drizzle. <laughs> <laughs> Where I help you? It is so good. Come here. You are just so sweet. Yes, you are. Yeah. You all come home. Come home and watch her. <laughs> come here, I'll help you. Yeah, you want a babysit? Right. You want a babysit? Who you texting, Jamal? Oh, yeah. Sorry. What's his, uh, what's his uh, American name? <laughs> he is American. Oh, there you go. Oh. His name is Miguel. <laughs> it's not. What's his name? He's Italian. He's, a he's not American. Luigi. Then. He's, he's a not American. He was born in America. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. We have Toad. 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 It's Italian. Italian white bread at Subway. Like, <laughs> like if you order the white bread, it's Italian bread. Yeah. See, yeah. but there's white white, like whole white, like where it's like yeehaw, you know. And then well, she does that too. I do not do that. Bulls. Every time somebody walks in here, she's like, "How y'all doing today?" Uh, yeah. you know, I do not. It's like, yeet. I do not. <laughs> yeet. Yeet. Like you guys locked in out there. Yeet. yeet. <laughs> I get sick of these cowboys. Like, wow. Yeah. And, you know, those guys are really nice to talk to. That cowgirl when we first talked to this cowgirl. <laughs> oh my God. How y'all doing today? <laughs> like that, he's white. That's white right That's there. That's white. That You're white. white right there. Yeah, redneck. White, white red. I'm about as white as I go. Yeah. I'm almost I know. transparent. I know. And then you have Phoenix. I'm like eggshell. Yeah. Phoenix, the giant teddy bear. Phoenix fades over Phoenix. there. Yeah, Phoenix. Just big old giant teddy bear. He looks scary. The Grizz. <laughs> who, who, was it, who was saying they were, oh, Dr. Bo? They were talking about how hairy they were. I said, hell, which boy just take your shirts off and wrestle around a little bit? Get a couple grizzly bears in here going at it. <laughs> so I'm like, hell yeah. Grizzly bears. Searching grizzly bear wrestling. Okay, I am not searching grizzly bears. I'm going for an Italian grizzly bear. Ooh, grizzly bears in the Italian sauce. Oh, yeah. <laughs> So what's his name, Chef Boyardee? Andrew. 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 His name's Andy. Andy. No, Andrew. Andy. Drew. Go by Drew now. <laughs> <laughs> I go by Drew now. I go by Drew. All right, Andy. All right. I'm not, I'm not, okay. I'm Andy. not gonna call you that. <laughs> it's okay. Can't control what you do. I can only control what I do. Sorry. Anyway, I can move it back to the office. Stevens. Thank you. No, that's not his last name. They said Andrew Stevens. No, that's his middle name is Steven. Andrew, Andrew Stevens. Yeah. Yeah. That's a white guy name. That's white as shit. Andrew man. is actually Italian. Anthony and is Italian, I will say that. Andrew is from the Bible. Italian? <laughs> well, it's from the Bible. Okay, so. It's like John. Yeah. It's from the Bible. Whatever, he's Italian. <laughs> Andrew is Italian. No, it's not. Okay, it's on the Bible. <laughs> so, he, <laughs> so it's Israeli? He eats meatball subs, dude. <laughs> so you're not helping your case at all. Yeah. <laughs> Shut up. It's a good thing you hired a lawyer. Because representing yourself would do no good. Chevy. <laughs> I object. What for? I, that, cause that's bull crap. Shut up, that's not what I would say. That has, no, I'm say bullshit. Yeah, yeah, say bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> it's 
see that. Let me Google contempt right, of court. She wouldn't talk to you whenever she came in because she can sense evil. I'm not. But she had no problem with talking to Cole. Absolutely not. No. That's crazy. She, was, she sat there and smiled at me the whole time. She wouldn't say a word to you though. But she smiled at me the whole time. Well, she was scared adorable. to so death. So that's of why you. she, she got that 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 so cute. Oh! Uh, just fell down from up, front, up top. Brought that in today for me. That's like one of the coolest hats I've ever seen. Hats ever. Like black camo too. What? What is it? Look at the inside of that. Hey, Cardinal said, he's like, dude, I've had this thing in my car and never wear it. He's like, yeah, What does the front look like? It's Cardinal's. Bird on oh my God. Okay. I thought about keeping it, but it won't. It's too big for me. So. Just wear it like what that. She said. Oh, it's your guy. Oh, yeah. Oh. Chevy. The Chevy. Andrew Stevens. I'm not going to give out last name. <laughs> well, we know it's going to search it. Hold and on, hold on, hold on. Does this last name start with an S? That would have been awesome because this would have been ass. Damn. All the time, well, guys. I, 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 I know. I mean, hey, I, I got a whole lot like of H? it. Is it like Ash, maybe? Is it an end of an H? I am. Or an a, a P? Is it Asp? Is it like a snake? Ashton. Is it Asp? Because that would be a snake. Is he a snake? Is he an Italian snake? Is he an Italian snake? Is he got the Italian snake? He's got the six inch stub and an Italian snake. He's a good cook. Well, that means a lot. Because you don't cook for shit. I was going to say, I mean, whenever you're the one that's the judge of that, like, I mean, you can, you've got toast down on lock. Oh, she's getting your toast. You can cook the a toast mean ass lasagna. She opens a can of freezer. Freezer. She opens a can of like mini ravioli better than anybody you'll ever see. Yeah, no shit. Okay. Uh, beefaroni. Love she's you. on it. Fuck you. I can cook when I want she's to. She's gonna treat you to like some fine Italian. You have no cuisine. I'm telling you, you what. Spaghetti. You can stick a frozen lasagna in an oven better than Siobhan. I, 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 okay. I'll give it to you. Okay. Gavin, Gavin. Salt pie, bitch. Salt pie. One time. Hey. One time. Hey. How many good things am I going to eat compared to one? Salt pie, dude. No, you're still fed me salt pie. Yeah, Gavin puts some lasagna in the oven. Well, I know Gavin does it. I don't know. <laughs> she puts it in, Gavin operates the oven. <laughs> <laughs> what does preheat mean? <laughs> oh, she knows what preheat means. <laughs> Ow, uh, shit! I, I know how to warm up an oven, boys. Woo! <laughs> Locked and loaded. Yeah, because that's what I sound like. Like, well, when you're in the mood, that's what we heard. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> it's what Aspen, Give it to the boys! That's what Aspen said, or whatever that dude's name is. Aspen. Oh, Aspie. Aspen Extreme. Aspen. What's his name? Andrew? Is it Andrew. Kutch? Yeah. Is it the Kutch? Drew? <laughs> he's white, but he gets a tan. He's, he's white, but he's a really nice tan. <laughs> he's got black hair, so he's Italian. He does have black hair. <laughs> See? Mm-hmm. Oh, what color is your natural hair? Dark brown. There's no such thing as black hair. There's no such thing as her natural You just color. said he has black hair. <laughs> well, yeah, because it looks black. Yeah, but no, just, hey, at this point, there's no such thing as her natural color. Uh, yeah, no, my natural <laughs> color is dark brown, okay? Like how dark? Like, I haven't seen it since I was like, like 11, like, like, but like, it was like, dark like brown. A, like a grayish dark brown? No, I have like two gray hairs, like okay? A, like a silvery dark brown? Called tinsel and it's pretty. Kind of a, okay. kind of a, uh, on a Christmas tree, yes. <laughs> <laughs> kind of a, on top of your head. <laughs> kind of a silverback dark brown. I mean, <laughs> I mean, the mixture of the gray and the dark that you got going on and the. I do not have a bald spot. Shut up. There is no thinning spot. Hey, hey, it's, it looks good today. It's all right. It's <laughs> difficult ball. <laughs> He's not denying I mean, it. Hey, I've accepted you know, it. You know, I do not have a bold spot. I'm healthy at that point. It starts to get. I, you know, I've accepted it at this point. So, it's about I mean, time you do it's it. All, it's one of the steps, Siobhan. I'm going to shave it all off. Acceptance you know I mean? is one of the steps. <laughs> it's not a step. People I still know. Acceptance is one of the steps, Siobhan. <laughs> okay, Chris Ryan. <laughs> Yeah, I see it in the morning. It's like really. I like, have, I have spent the night there before oh, yeah. he came out there to bring me my smoothie. I just bust out laughing. I'm like, oh my god. 
<laughs> That's like... It's so bad. <laughs> four numbers better than he looks in the morning. <laughs> I mean, could you imagine, like, being Justine and rolling up first? <laughs> <laughs> like, crawl over on him. this baby girl. <laughs> I'm in a love-making mood. Wake you, a little wakey pokey. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh, first oh. you take off your Bane mask and then, you know. Hold on. <laughs> it's just leave it on and fuck. <laughs> this is what love looks like. You were fucked off. That would be extremely painful. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh my god. god. <laughs> will you die if I take off that mask? No, but it'd be extremely painful. You're never here. I know. What? What's I, up? I'm here till noon. I know. <laughs> you're you're just early today. Oh. Like seeing an eclipse. How you doing, brother? <laughs> yeah, you know, you got a rep. Well, yeah. yeah. I know. That's all good. It's all good. All right. Nobody's bigger Kansas City fan than Phoenix. So yeah. excited for Sunday. So excited. So excited. To oh. see everybody put all their cheeks gear away. <laughs> right. Yeah, it, yeah, I know. I'm, but I'm a fan since 63. You've been through, you've been through the rough ones with us. Yeah, I've like been, that? I have never wasted. With us. I've been a fan since 63. Cause like, yeah, you've been through the rough times with us. <laughs> yeah. Uh, the rough times were in the 90s, bub. Man. <laughs> Basically, <laughs> any year that actually just had a nine in it. Or the rough times. <laughs> <It> ain't wrong. <laughs> or a divider by nine. Or a divider by three. They ain't wrong. Yeah. Anyone with a one or a three, maybe a two in it? Andrew. Ugh. I knew I shouldn't have said anything. Andrew Stephen one. You should look up. See if you can. Look up Italian Andrew. Yeah, just, just look, type in Italian just, Andrew. Just look up is that Andrew. Is that her Italian Andrew? Yeah, basically. Just get Shimon from. Well, why? It's going to be under like. He's got a real name on it's gonna be big Facebook. Under, under is uh, Andrew hey, Italian on Grindr. We don't want to look at our chat. <laughs> we don't wanna, I don't want to look at their chat. You don't want to look at our chat. <laughs> I don't want to send me boob pictures you sent him. Boob pictures. I do. <laughs> I'll, I'll, I'll scroll through it real quick. <laughs> I'll, 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 I'll give you some. Uh, I'll give you some pointers. You know. I'm gonna go ahead and take one for the team here, fellas. Uh, <laughs> Good was wearing, wearing her chief shirt today. Shavon is. Bry was. Bry was the one you gave me yesterday. How, how, Close was it? It fit good. Did it? Yeah. Good. So I made sure the boys both went in their hoodies. Me too, but mine says Kate and says Dallas Cowboys, so. He didn't have a Chiefs one? I don't know if he uh, wore a Chiefs one. I thought I got him a Chiefs one here. Yeah, he has a Chiefs one. Maybe what? I mean, obviously he wants the Chiefs to win. Does he? Of course he does. His Cowboys can't. <laughs> Big one. <laughs> no, he gets it. <laughs> <laughs> no, that is download YouTube TV now for him so he can have all the sports all the time. Well, he wanted to watch. He wanted to watch the award ceremony last night, and he he got yeah. He was like, he was like, mom, mom, mom. And I was like, wait, like Patrick Mahomes just got VIP, and I was like, that's awesome. Got what? Damn, HIV! 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 HIV!
song I was telling you about. Oh, that one? That's him. That's him? That's him. He's on the Lakers now. Calling a young The one they were all singing? Yeah. Yeah. The Bengals were singing. Yeah, the, the whole Bengals stadium was singing that when the team came out. They're pretty excited about the pickup, too. Who's his brother Law play for? Hey, that's his Italian brother. It's his Italian brother. It's Andy brother. La Bamba. Spaghetti and meatballs, Doritos and Cheetos. Hey, La Bamba is my dad. <laughs> <laughs> it was Mo Bamba and La Bamba. Oh my god. <laughs> Kobe. Kobe. <laughs> that's like yeah. La Bamba. He gets it's like the Mamba, yeah. Mo Bamba, the Mamba. Lil Mamba. Lil Mamba. Bo, Ma Bo Mamba? What time does the party start at Sunday, Cole? I don't have a party. Yeah, what time is the party? We all want to know. I don't have a party. <laughs> what time is the party at Ray's Ridge? Yeah, what time is the party? I guess I better ask Justine. I don't know. She's, she's, she's going to be in Iraq, so who knows? Yeah, she's going to be in Iraq, so <laughs> what time the party? <laughs> Talk to party. So what time's the party? What time's the party? Just, I gotta go to family day at Justine's. Quit making a bunch of shit excuses and tell us what time the party is. I've got to go to family day at Justine's work first. I don't know what time Nobody cares over. about family day. What time's the party? <laughs> 8 o'clock. Oh, is it? Have family day what time does the game start? It's at 5.30. <laughs> so he meant 8 o'clock in the morning. Yeah, it's all day we'll, events. <laughs> we'll see you guys the next day. We're going to uh, hair the dog We're doing it on Monday. <laughs> We're going to do ours on Monday. We're doing a little cheap spray on Monday here at the shop. <laughs> Phoenix leading the way. No, he's not. I want you to meet my new friend. Italian Andy leading the way. Italian Andy? Yeah. He's bringing the meatball party? subs. No. I don't have a party. You're sick anyway. I don't want you in my house. I'm here, honey. Uh, sorry. That's two days away. Sorry, bud. Sorry, bud. Yep. Sorry, buddy. You're disqualified. I was really hoping she was going to call in sick today. That way I could tell her she couldn't come to my house this weekend. Oh, wow. I listen. I have Yeah. Well, she's the one sick cutting your hair, bub. Sorry. I'm not sick. Just not sick. No. Don't put your sick your friends that high. That's true. That's true. That shit sucks. I'm going to lose this Sunday. Oh, come on now. <laughs> I'm going to lose this Sunday. Oh, come on now. <laughs> who's the best quarterback of all time? Who's the greatest quarterback of all time? Yeah. Tom Brady. Oh. Nah. Joe Montana. Joe Montana is good. He was the greatest of all time. Brady's got way more championships than Montana does. He's talking about heart. Montana. That's true. As far as just good heart quarterback. Sure. I like Joe. He was the reason I'm a Chiefs fan. I started off as a Niners fan when I was a little kid, and then when he came to Kansas City, I was a Chiefs fan. Oh, you suck, <laughs> 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 Yes! So why, why are you rooting for the Eagles then? Because they don't suck. What? Because they don't suck balls. The, the Eagles don't suck balls? No. What? Oh, my God. What does that got to do with Joe Montana? That makes sense because uh, no, 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 on the list of what he was just saying, because he couldn't get the big W. Uh, he won championships for the Niners. He didn't know. Yeah, he did. And he had a paper that he played now. Montana? Yeah. He played for the 49ers. He did not. Joe Montana? Yeah. He won championships for the 49ers. Sure did. Yep. I mean, oh, crap, boy. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Chief suck balls? <laughs> Man, that's giving you what you deserve, Paul. Soul a little bit. No, giving you what you deserve. I just listen. Hey, oh. you want to get into what people deserve? What? Phoenix get it. Phoenix would not. We're best friends. So when are you guys moving these stations next to each other? Never. It's happening. I guess you could never show up to work anyways. I. <laughs> Let's turn her station into the podcast, though. Uh, put her station there right next to the window over there next to Phoenix. The way we can open this wall back up over here. 
I guess it wouldn't be that bad. I mean, she'd never get a beat away. Station so. buddies with uh, penis. She'll never beat away. She ain't never here. So. Do you be nice to her? What? Be nice to her. Be nice to her? Why? She's mean to me. I'm not. She would for you for one reason. Well, she's my sister-in-law. So I, I, she deserves to get her ass chewed a little bit. <laughs> no, she does not. Okay. <laughs> She's mean to my wife. No, never. That's my baby sister. I've never been mean to All her. the time. Mm -hmm. All the time. I've never been mean to All the time. So, the only reason why you mean that too, so, just let me be next 50 years for it, and then uh, the new mean. That's all right. We'll be in the Super Bowl next year. No, you won't. <laughs> yeah, we will. Still, so. We'll be in the Super Bowl next couple years. No, no. Probably three or four. No. no. Probably at least five. No. Losing every one of them. <laughs> Might lose all of them, but by God, we'll be there. What about the Patriots? What do you think about them? Never going to win. Never going to win. You hear that? Never. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> That's how it, I want to be a good boy. <laughs> well, he's ruthless about those jeans. I like jeans. him. Oh, yeah. He's, <coughs> he's fun. He sticks up for me. I he like is him. ruthless about my jeans. I'm telling you. <laughs> I'm telling you. Hey, you need, to tell him, you, know, you need to tell him about Joe Montana and the 49ers. You know, right. He doesn't believe that Joe Montana played for the 49ers. I said he won championships with him. He yeah, said, absolutely. I was full of crap. <laughs> yeah, he's got lots to learn, y'all. You know. <laughs> I told him the reason I'm a Chiefs fan is because of Montana. <laughs> yeah, he's, uh, he was a, a fan hopping football. And I'm like, no, no, no. You jump around him. a little bit? Oh. Whoever was hot that year was his yeah. favorite. I said, you got to pick a team. He's like, Phoenix, I got you. Yeah. <laughs> Go Eagles? No, I just don't like the teams. I want the teams. He has two favorite teams. Who are the, the whoever and His is the Patriots the, and then whoever's playing the Chiefs. Right. Yeah, that's Phoenix's yeah. favorite teams. I know. Uh, yeah, but I mean, I'm all Boston. <laughs> Phoenix is so That's scary. a ghost cow. He's hoping the Chiefs win. <laughs> smart pop. Smart pop. That guy's got smart pop. It's a ghost cow. <laughs> you think I might think of a Boston accent. That's why I always go to. <laughs> it's a ghost cow. That guy's got smart pop. <laughs> He's a Lakers fan too? He likes Kobe. Oh. I mean Kobe, yeah. Like, that's, that's a legit life. Now the new Lakers, who? Yeah. Lakers ten years ago. Are you a big LeBron fan too? Mm -hmm. Are you? Ouch. <laughs> Ouch. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, oh, Is he your favorite player? Yeah. LeBron's your favorite player? Yeah. Is he? Have you ever heard of Michael Jordan? <laughs> um. Have you heard of Steve Young? No. <laughs> Steve, Steve, Steve Young? Yeah. Oh, Steve Young, football player, yeah. Oh, goodness, yes. Yeah, he took over Joe Montana's spot in San Francisco. Not, not that kind of Steve Young I'm thinking about. Which one are you thinking of? Steve Nash. Steve Nash. Yeah, Steve Nash, yeah. Yeah, Steve Nash. There you go, Thank you. Dang. Who's he coaching? Who's he coaching? <laughs> Who's he coaching now? Nobody. You probably want money. <laughs> and kids coach in Dallas? I mean, that's I mean, what I love being You know, here. as much fun as you got to have. I mean, you know. You, know, you, know, with the you ought to be paying me. Until. <laughs> like, it was? No, Nash. Nash. Right. Until, like, I don't know, like, first part of the season. And there was definitely some issues there, I think, between them and Katie and, um, Kyrie and Nash had had enough, so he wasn't going to get anymore. Get him to calm down a little bit. No, I can't. <laughs> <laughs> like, I'd like to get him in the damn car. <laughs> what was he saying there earlier? I said something about his hand. Um, I can't remember. It was. Somebody, somebody said something about cutting a hand off. I said, he's going to go to that guy anymore. <laughs> My favorite was when he used to tell people when we were kids, like, I'm pretty classy, but I'm your hand. I'm shark bit off, bro. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> I was the thing for a long time. More times than not, when he comes in here, I try to come up with a new way. Yeah. Like all the time, like he'll say one time he came in and he was talking about him and the Sherry going to the zoos all the time, and I was like, dude, I'm surprised they get you back to the zoo after the accident. It's just like, <laughs> yeah, dude. <laughs> The worst thing, though, is literally we'll have like a little kid sitting oh, here worst in the one. and it'll be like, don't move, don't move. <laughs> <laughs> the kids are like, oh, shit. <laughs> 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 He's at the shop yesterday. Yeah. Yeah, just let me know when you're there. I'll come give you a hand. Like, <laughs> 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 like, great, you can hold the backside of the hole. You already gave one. Yeah. <laughs> Let him stir the gravy with that, huh? <laughs> it's the best little stirrer out there. <laughs> oh my goodness. The pot stirrer. Him and Kevin got taken in one night by Manson, and they were just four of us one night in the back of the cop car and like singing and shit. What they were like? Singing to the microphone, he says. Oh, it's a fire. Singing to the microphone, boo boo. We had the conversation with him in here about how to handcuff him. He's like, oh, zip tied my, my belt loop. I'm like, really? He's like, they take a zip tie and then zip tie it around the end of his nub, like, hard, like, cinch that dude down and then zip tie it to his belt loop. We just don't have to worry about, you know, that being be amputated for lack of blood circulation. <laughs> oh, my God. Well, I figured as many, many times he's been arrested, they'd rigged up something better for him. I figured they had, like, a big Chinese finger cuff. Oh, oh, giant Chinese finger cuff. Chinese finger cuff. <laughs> Zip tie, I think. Yeah, zip tied around the nub and yeah, then zip tied his belt loop. How would that? Hmm. Seems like it sucked. Well, it's, it's, oh, yeah, it's it still feels like, like it would be, you'd still be able to kind of get that oh, out. Oh, no. Like, Not no, if you pull they, it down tight enough. I mean, they, they cinched that dude down. Hmm. I mean, unless he's like spitting on him. I mean, I would. Wait, what? Zip ties that they put on him. Cut off circulation? Well, you're gonna lose a hand. That's not what I just said. Wait, no. Yeah, okay. What's your Valentine's plans, Chevy? Mm -hmm. Great. Oh, one out of big Italian. Well, one out of big Italian. It is a big hit, big, huh? I did a split trying to make a joke. A little Italian? No, he's big. Where are you guys going? Um. Coley's? Yep. Super <laughs> Bowl party. Range Ridge. Go to the Range Ridge, you know. Go hang out there. I don't know where I'll be. Somebody be there. <laughs> we'll be there waiting on you. Sweet, I'm going freaking uh, uh, <laughs> Tall Tales. <laughs> Somebody was in here saying what are they doing? 85 bucks. And all you, I think 85 all you can drink in a buffet at Tall Tales in the Super Bowl. Damn, Stokes is really is a discount on that. I'm telling you. It was like 85 bucks, all you could do drafts and wells. A person or what? Yeah, and then a buffet. Oh. Colby hurts up. Colby, you know any Italian guys? First uh, name Andrew. Oh my Italian God. Guys and Andrew. Italian guys and Andrew. Andy, Drew, Andrew. <laughs> so I guess my question there is, is what? How did he prove that he was Italian? I guess you just really said, like. Hey, it's a me. You can you can tell he's Italian. The flavor, the flavor. He's Italian, and his voice is very Italian too. Does he speak Italian? Some. You can tell what uh, can tell where he's from by those kind of pictures. <laughs> you just tell he's Italian. His voice, everything, just comes off very Italian. Really? Yeah. See, you don't. Oh, shut up, Phoenix. I'm not going to keep on having this great. argument with you. She's country great. Italian. Great Italian. <laughs> he said, hey, it's a me. <laughs> Andrew. <laughs> <laughs> he had to no, save the princess. He, 
you to save the princess. <laughs> Another VIP, just like my homers. Uh, <laughs> oh, VIPs all the way. Shut up. <laughs> Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Do you speak Italian? I speak a little Italian. You do? Italian. Okay. Yeah. Let's hear it. Uh, spaghetti. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, lasagna. Chicken Alfredo. <laughs> <laughs> Extra Egg and blended parmesan. Uh, <laughs> a pepperoni, a pizza. The story. My great grandparents immigrated here from Italy to Ellis Island, then to Manhattan. To Oak Island? Did and they find it? No. <laughs> Seriously, Oak Island. Did no. It? Did they find it? No. Anyway, I'm look, sure button. Find it. my great grandparents never spoke English, so my grandma knew how to speak pretty good Italian, so every once in a while she would speak Italian, and my mom and Aunt Vicky and all of them. No A pepperoni time. hot pocket. <laughs> oh my god. It's I, do, I do know some words like uh, fungal, it's fuck you, I'm Italian. Oh. oh so we know the cuss words, huh? Uh huh, that's good. Yeah. The word is curse. I thought that was French. That is French. Nice try, Chevy. Uh, cacao, bathroom. Sure borders or something. Cacao, some pork, I don't know. Cacao. Are you just making stuff up? I'm not making stuff up. You say the chain is a pork? No, but chain. Butt chain. Butt chain. <laughs> the butt chain? Sorry, guys. Butt chain. Butt chain. Yes, butt chain cool, yes. Butt chain is, is Italian pork? for pork, yes. Oh, that's yep. A, that's an Italian band, Andrew and the Butt Chain. <laughs> Coley told me a little over a year ago that this was going to be like a, a trial thing. <laughs> Trials come to an end. And I'm wondering when that happens. I think she's about to go for Yeah. You know Coley, dude. He's too soft. He likes him. softy. <laughs> that is true. Cole is what a good softy. Cole huh? doesn't like confrontation, and he's a softy. Softy. But Cupcake. But if you yelling, he's scary as shit when he yells. Oh, he's a sure. yeller. Yeah. Oh, I like scary. the scream. <laughs> yeah, he's scary whenever he yells. I don't like it. It scares me. I was going to say, but it only scares Siobhan. <laughs> so. He scares his kids. And the dogs at his house. They'll Sir. piss right in the floor. How do you do a haircut? I mean, I, I watch a lot of Western movies. And, uh, you know, in a fight scene, their hair is never messed up. <laughs> and... They may be in bed and they get up and their hair's still. Oh, well, that's just a cowboy. Yeah. Yeah. The county, <laughs> what do you do to make it? I'm not messed up. They literally have makeup artists and hair. I was going to say, you got no, a hair I'm hair right and a makeup artist. No, I mean, cowboy. I mean, is there a. Cowboy shit. A do or a way you cut it that. To where you can get up in the morning and it won't be messed up? Yeah, I mean, I cut it about that long right there. <laughs> I was saying, it won't be messed up one bit. <laughs> this right morning. here. I'll this is this so. haircut. <laughs> Come Come wake up and go. Yep. Don't even look, look in the mirror. No. It ain't worth it. Well, but he's uh, it's not a real cowboy either. I'll try to be crazy. Now I just wondered if there was a. I thought they were about to see a UFC fight between Cole and Coulter. He said, when the Cowboy about to snap on this dude. You're about to be an only child, Casey. No, that's another thing. That's where Coulter draws the line. I guess I'm too much of an old man. I don't want the hairdos today. I got you. Yeah, I, if there was a way to leave it long and it not be messed up when you wake up in the morning, I'd be anxious to find that out myself. So. Your hair's not messed up in the morning, Cole. <laughs> 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 I'm 
<laughs> it's scary. That's wild. Man. It's scary. <laughs> but you know, I've seen it maybe blow in the wind a little bit, but it's not blow out the place. Phoenix, where'd you guys get all these deer heads? Thrift store. And dirty clay. Probably buy a storage unit or something. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we just do that as a surprise for him one time. Yeah. For like a birthday present. Like a Super Bowl party present. There you go. What time's that party? 5 30. Y'all gonna start drinking that early? 9 30. Was it bring a covered dish and some briskies or what? 9 30 in the morning? No, not. Yeah, I feel like we just all kind of like do like a fresh spring of potluck. Yeah, thing. like a potluck deal. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, 9.30 in the morning. Just be prepared to party. What out. time are we supposed to be up at the helicopter rides? The family helicopter rides? Oh, hell, I don't know on that. Where are you down to? Can you just pick us up down here and then like run us up there and back in the chopper? Sure. Nope. Cool. <laughs> with that 50 cal eat. Be the door gunner for a little while. Yeah. Totally. Easy. Easy. Just don't lead them as much. <laughs> I guess we won't know. I think we ought to put him somewhere else. Uh, that ain't gonna work. Colbert's trying to get Shaq here. Shaq. <laughs> Shaq. Replace him with Shaq. <laughs> so we're putting Shaq one in here. Put that Colbert corner. Come up to about his crotch. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say it has to be a real size guy. Would that be okay if you pulled there? Would be the worst. Would be the worst thing. Would right. <laughs> be the worst things that could happen with me and Shaq. He's got that. Andy guy's got a big. Did you shoot. like that picture I sent you this morning, Coulter? It was, on, it was on Facebook, so just be prepared for more people. It's all over Facebook. Y'all blessed, Jay. I was sitting in here, I came across it, so I decided to send it to you. Yeah, it was awesome. Do you see the resemblance, though? Can you see it? I don't see I it. I showed it to Casey, he's on. Oh. Yeah, it was spot on. Sorry. I don't see it at all. Like a thousand percent. Yeah. There's no way that you just don't see it. <laughs> You're lying. I just think it's funny because that was its advertisement on Netflix, so like everyone's gonna see that advertisement. So yeah, like we're getting like some more free advertising. Free advertising, for sure. We're gonna use that as a thumbnail for the podcast. Yeah. Good Colt 45 in that yeah. picture. <laughs> Colt 420. <laughs> there you go. Wait, the old Google I'll write out the chat. I'll write out the chat. <laughs> We said they're gaps? Uh-huh. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Oh. Two. Five. Ten. What are you laughing for? You gonna throw yours in circle two? Shut up. Nobody asked you, Phoenix. Why does it always gotta swing back around to me? Huh? Oh, she's gonna have another test. That's part of the, uh, <laughs> part of the deal. Like if I say anything on Facebook, in my dad and brother's favor, it's always gonna come back on me. <laughs> huh? That is oh. funny. That what? is funny. <laughs> he says that all the time in here. What do you say? He says that anytime that you and your dad get going it? on somebody, and he's like, "Yeah, that's right." And both of you like, like oh, turn yeah. around and flip and like, "Coley, you shut up." <laughs> hey, 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 little bitch just chimed in. <laughs> I was on your side, guys. That's yeah, like, what are you out there shooting phones? Yeah. <laughs> 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 
Yeah. Yeah. What's the use? <laughs> What's the use? Thank you, guys. Thank you, brother. If there, you guys ever get on a rant on anybody on Facebook, and I keep like, you guys are like, look at this little bitch and this little deer. Oh, look at this little pussy boy, nice little pussy deer. I'd be like, yeah, guys, that one's small. You'd be like, oh, would you kill this deer, you little bitch boy? Huh? What'd you get? Oh, uh, go never, meet in the freezer for this little pussy boy. Number one, I've never shamed anybody's deer, right. other than yours. <laughs> So he's just in here spreading lies about you, Casey? Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah, that I believe. Well, absolutely. We get asked all the time, anytime that Coley gets to miss work for a day to go hunting or something like that. And he what if I missed work to go uh, hunt? Man. Not lately. Not lately. Years like, ago. Like years ago. Like maybe whenever we first started. Yeah, you know, like years ago. <laughs> people were asking if he was out there killing anything. I'd just, time. Just, <laughs> <laughs> a lot of times, killing it. Time. Yeah. Slaughtering the time. <laughs> He's probably asleep somewhere you know, under a tree. About like, about like Colby hunting in Colorado, really. You know? uh, Killing a box of Twinkies or a little Debbie's cake and stuff like that. I wish oh, you guys kill some you think it's bad, but if you were actually there in real life, you would see how bad it is. <laughs> like, you're know, like three shots off in the distance. You're like, what the fuck? You get over there and Colby's like, oh shit, dude, I... The whole like, what, hands what, on the trigger. What'd you shoot, dude? <laughs> what'd you shoot, bro? Ah, shit, I don't know. It looked like something pretty decent. There was this one buck, and I was I lit a cigarette, and I looked over, and I... Lit a cigarette? I heard the damn buck sneeze. <laughs> and I looked over, and I was like, hell, that'll work. And I looked behind that son of a bitch, and there was another little bit bigger one. So I just went ahead and shot it. You get up there, and it's like, it's this fucker. You know, <laughs> that fucker in there. He's like, is that, that a pretty good one? Where was should it? I go? Was it? Where was should it? I go, guys? Was it pretty good? One? Was it? Uh, was it pretty good? One? That one Phoenix picked up to the thrift store. <laughs> was it a pretty good? One? Needed a year. Said on the back of it, needed a year. So was it a pretty good? One? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I mean, they're nice, but that cow that Casey had hanging in the barn that, that one cow. year. All right. I think we ought to do a Buzzin Faded sponsored trip to Colorado. Do a little elk hunt. There we go. Do a little uh, hit the slopes, hit the bunny hunt the slopes a little bit. Uh, <laughs> Sip a little whiskey, see where it takes us. Yes. <laughs> Is this recent? Is here? Yeah. Yeah, that one's pretty fresh. We'll say that's the first time I've ever seen that. The other one's been like that for a while, but that one's pretty fresh. And that's like after draining like five cc's out of it twice too. It was dude, there was like, I got a picture I have to show you. There was a ping pong ball off the side of my fucking ear. It's crazy. Rinse down on the side of your damn head. I use my head for a lot of things, like <laughs> literally. A push people around with the side of my head a lot. <laughs> like a bull? I mean, sometimes. Yeah. I guess you could say that. I'm not like a bull in any regard, but <laughs> yeah, I use my head. Like, what's the weirdest thing you've done with your head? <laughs> <laughs> that would be exactly why, why are we, what why are we, turn, why are we turning it into this? That would be exactly what Colder would He's like, what do you like, mean by so that? Serious. He's like, so, uh, let's hear some stories about maybe some of the weird shit you've done with your head. <laughs> Trendy. Oh, <laughs> is it painful even now it's still a little tender right now but it's i mean it's a couple weeks in so it's starting to get pretty solid it's 
clock out time for old Coley. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say. Like Dude. I say, you can keep going all day or what? Uh, oh, yeah. got 20 minutes. Huh? I got 20 minutes, but I called it. Why does Snoop Dogg have an umbrella? The drizzle. Yes. No, he already, yeah. no, he already said He that. says, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You ever hear like, give me a little outro? Whenever a little you're outro? Yeah. Whenever mm -hmm. you're done. Hey guys, thanks for tuning in to Buzz and Faded's pilot podcast. We're going to do some editing and see how this the goes. One, uh, turns out alright, we'll keep doing a few more. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs>